Hello, all my beautiful heroes. Welcome, welcome. Hello to hello. <laughs> Never gets old. Paladin, Jorah, and Cookie. Hello to all my lurkers. Welcome, welcome, guys. Happy Tuesday. Um, let's jump right into this thing. We, we, hello. We, uh, we have to get, we have to get, we have to get through this game. In some capacity. Oh wait, let's let's give it some sound. We gotta we gotta like I don't know, get an ending or get some information. I, I need something. Um, let's see. What, what? Oh, that's right. Okay, we were gonna try to do this like quick end, and then I realized because nobody got nine, it probably wouldn't be quick. That's where we are. Where where we are. We got um. 10 Miyoji's ending last time after the flow chart extended yet again. Um, and then we got a, another death ending there and there, I believe. One of those two. Never gets old, my mission has been achieved. Perfect. As Miro, end, end of chart branches infinite. So infinite. It's everywhere, all the time. Um, let's see. Okay, what do we do? We chose to uh, betray Luna. Oh, she's not gonna be happy about that. Okay, we chose to betray Luna. And if you ally with Luna, it leads to like this whole big long shebang. So we'll betray her, and then we'll go back to ally, and we'll be friends with her again. Um, let's see where let's see where betraying her gets us. Perhaps that I made a promise to Fi. A promise, huh? Were you really sure Kay wouldn't betray you? Of course you? not. I'm not an idiot. This seems a little bit loud. Is this loud for anybody else? Is the game loud, you guys? Hold up. It might just be me. We're gonna give it like a bat. Uh huh. Sounds okay I didn't to you. really have okay. a choice, though. Might just be me then. My sound settings are like all screwy after yesterday, so. The only option was to trust him. <laughs> that's yeah. so. Don't you think that's important? Trusting someone, I mean. Sure. Mm hmm. All right. We should go and look for Quark, too. Maybe just a tad bit loud. Okay. We gotta, we, gotta, we gotta fix these. Hey, Julie, welcome. How are you? Hello, hello. Happy Tuesday. Indeed. Uh, okay. Quark is missing in this one. Oh, God, I don't remember what happened. Hold on. Can we, like, zoom in here? This is the Golem Bay. Oh, no, no, don't. No, do not. I can't, like... Okay, there we go. Um... Yeah, so it was just the Golem Bay, and then we got to talk with the Cockney robot. And I guess Quirk is missing in this one. In th was this the one where... I think this was the one where Quark... got sick before going into the second door, rather than getting sick after they got out of the second door. You know, you know you want to go back to the Golem Bay. I do. I do, though, actually. <laughs> I want to talk with uh, Mr. Cockney Robot a bunch more. Um, we did say, and each... We did, we did say? We did say what? Best we split up when you say we did say. We did say. That's not how you reply to that. And each one of us left for a different area of the facility. I looked at the magenta door. Phi, I took magenta. Phi went to yellow. K went to cyan. Gonna be lurky today. That's totally cool, Julie. I appreciate you being here. Lurk away. Nowhere to be found. Let me guess. Is he absolutely nowhere? Wow, this is this is new. We aren't like getting the little dot beeping around the map, and we aren't we aren't getting our hot door action. What's happening? Incredible. I would love to go back in time to when the coffee robot was alive. Hey, Seishi, welcome. I'm still not caught up on the VODs I've missed. Good thing the story uh, ends <laughs> are new each time. Mm-hmm, yep. You don't need them. Um, no matter how hard I looked, Cork couldn't be found. Eventually, I decided to go back to the warehouse. He's probably in the pod, right? Oh. What time Yoji found him? Oh, shit. No, this will be a bad end because Quark has nine. I just figured we wouldn't find him. But since he found him, he's going to use him to open up the door. And then what, like just chuck his body outside? What's the plan here? Ten Miyoshi, what's going on? You you found Quark? Where was I he? I gotta tell you that. 
guys. When did I do something you wrong? broke your promise to Luna. I don't like people who break promises. I, I might have done that. My root beer! You mean the root beer in his hat? Hot <laughs> tour action or riot? Well, unfortunately, it looks like we're gonna have to riot. Unless this door opens. This would be, the, the number nine door opening is like the pinnacle of hot door action, right? I think, I think that's how it works. There's no rebuttal for that. Well, I'm glad ah. you found him. Oh, you got some balls saying that. Acting like you give a shit about him. You're right, I don't. Is he okay? He's just he looks sleeping. tired. Seems somebody shot him up with some kind of anesthetic. He looks sleepy. Somebody and who? Honestly, Probably I don't really Luna. care anymore. Can you imagine releasing bears from your hat? Perfect. Oh, oh, oh. His hat contains root bear. God. That would be a weird soda. Root bear? I'm gonna stretch you guys out a little bit more, make you taller. You don't you don't give a shit about him either, Fizz? Welcome to the stream, Fizz. Hi, how are you? Happy Tuesday. Um, I don't know why I feel the need today to tell everybody happy Tuesday, but fuck it. Happy motherfucking Tuesday. Should we shoot him in the anus? That's how you get rid of zombies. That's that's the only point that stops zombies. Not headshots anymore, no no. The bot is on point. <laughs> I mean, any of those quotes, really. Let's let's be real. They're, they're gold. Court safe. Uh, now, all I have to do is get him out of here. And this will all be He really over. does just plan to, like, chuck him out, out the door. You make it sound like you can get out hey. right now. Well, he can. Didn't How? you see the results? Quark's PP is... Nine. He's a nine boy. Happy fucking Tuesday. I hope I did the little, the little dot dudes justice. I don't know how to read the O with the dots. His what? B BP. BP with a B for bear. Exactly. His body points? His. What does BP stand for? We learned what it stood for. Blood pressure? His blood pressure is, is yeah, over nine. Of course he's gonna need my help to do that. What about you? You've only got four. You can't get out the. If you can get the door open, you'll. Three! Now, maybe some of you are thinking! Bracelet You're points, thinking, bracelet oh, oh. points, that's right. Nutella, thank you so much and if welcome to the stream. Hi, how are you? Then I'll just have someone with enough BP open the door. And I'll just slip through when it's open. But that's not gonna happen. Bandaged if what? Or bang, sneaky. banged? Well. No. That's how you interpret it? Cool, I nailed it then. <laughs> think I don't know that. Doesn't matter though. So long as Quark is safe. Is he I... safe though? Because I'm pretty sure he's sick of shit. Wow, this is like the ultimate bad ending where literally everybody dies. Uh, I barely even saw his move. It wasn't until pain exploded in my stomach that I realized Tenmyoji had kicked me. He's got some lethal little feats. Her gurk. That's also the noise that I make when I get kicked in the stomach. A good herk and a gurk. What a cork, man. Was having sort of a mellow day, and then you read a heartbreaking story from the host of one of your favorite podcasts. Oh no, no. Well, maybe you can have some laughs here, and we can turn it around. <laughs> oh my God, let's not talk in all caps hashtags in the chat. Jesus. Um, I let out a strange sort of wheeze and collapse to the floor, blinking against the pain. I managed to find Ten Miyoji again. He maneuvered Quark up to the number nine door. <laughs> the Vampire Slayer. Oh, interesting. I don't think I've ever heard of that podcast. I herked and a gurked again. Stop, Ten Miyoji. Moving made me wretch. And before I could recover and call out again, he'd done it. I don't think I've ever been kicked in the stomach. Does it, does it make you want to throw up? She only does because she knows I can't read it. Vampire Slayer, I need to leave. Goodbye, Seishi. Buffering. Buffering the Vampire Slayer. Oh, so it's like a play on Buffy the Vampire Slayer. Ha ha. Ah, I see. Um, Tamioji's hand pressed Quark's against the lever. He looked back at me over his shoulder. Do you think we'll get to listen and go crazy and die on the other side of the door? I mean, since 
Since he already has Radical Six, he can just like go outside, right? And be fine and not Sorry. have to give a shit about it. Sorry, door's almost open, so it's time I was on my way. The, the pollution in the world. Tell me you don't be an idiot. If you go through there, Believe you'll- me. I know, but I gotta stay with him as long as I can. Couldn't live with myself if I just tossed him out there unconscious, Would you know? Would you really do this? Then stay here. I can't do that. Why There's not? A killer here. It's too dangerous. I can't take that risk with Quark's life. Hey, squid! S squid of the... Squid of the near? Squid of the janeer? Mm-hmm. Yep. How's it going, squid? Is radical radical sex not in all the endings? It's in all the endings. I well, yeah, no, it's in all of them. I think so far. There's only been one though where we've cured him. The number nine door has been opened. It will remain open for nine. <laughs> for radical seconds. sex. Is that all anybody's here for? See ya. Temioji, wait! Don't do this, Temioji. Temioji. Scream into the void. Look at that hot door action from afar. It's pretty top. Look at it. Look at it. It's even closing. The number nine door has closed. Is there an ending where you just watch, you just make the watch kill you? Um, yeah, that happened in the ending where we took off Kay's hat. Um, we died via the bracelet. This ends the nonary game. Thank you. As the escape. Okay, escape is not possible. Please enjoy your stay. It's always mentioned, but behind the magenta door, Quark's, Quark goes missing after the second set of chromatic doors instead of falling ill. So in the ones where he just goes missing, then he's not sick? Or I, I assume that even though he went missing, he's still always sick. Uh, that's how it ended. Had Tenmuji died? Had Quark escaped? I didn't know. I laid my hand gently across my aching stomach and stared at the ceiling. Faint, approaching footsteps echoed through the warehouse. One of them was a killer. Whatever. It didn't matter anymore. I was never going to see the outside world again. Perhaps it would be better to just let them kill me. I lay back and closed my eyes. Oh, publicly falling ill. I see. Okay, and then trying to kill himself. Got you, got you. Okay, so that was a quick ending, and I, I just misjudged it last time. Well, whatever. Boop. And just for Blacko's sake. Boop. Alright. Um. Let's see. So now we should probably... Wow, I'm amazed we still don't have this one. This one, after the escape room, never had another story check, so maybe this one never will either. Okay, so in this one, um, here, you know what, we'll, we'll just, we'll do like some of this. This is what, this is what goes down. If we choose ally instead of a tray. Results, please. Thirty hours. Must be at least three, maybe four hours of non-chatting gameplay in there. Mmm, yep. And at least, at least a solid hour of hot door action. At least. Okay, and this one Quark got nine as well, but nobody could fucking find him. Um, okay. Points, please. Blah, 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 blah. All right, and then Luna's really happy. Uh, they're, they spat because they chose Betray. We all agree to, I don't remember, go, f oh, we have to go find out what everybody else's bracelet is, I think, because we don't know. So we go off to the crew quarters and we talk to Alice and we saw her bracelet and then, oh yes, we uncover the knife cloth, the knife cloth. Um... Okay, then we come in here and Temioji makes us check our bracelets and neither of us are the killers. Um, so Phi and Sigma are good to go. We realize what his bracelet is. We find the white doors. We talk to Dio. Dio's still a piece of shit, as usual. Why not? We figure out what his bracelet is. 
we talk about how that thing sounded cryptic about the ninth, the blind eats the ninth sun. We still haven't discovered what, what that's huh? about. Okay, and then we uncover that uh, these cubes have moved and somebody had stuffed a bloody knife down in one of them and they were the killer of the old woman and we're assuming it was Luna, which is crazy. But then Luna's dead. All right, so why were you late? Boob stab. Yep, we got the boob stab. So Alice is dead. Now Luna's dead. Hey, Spell, welcome. Hello, hello. <laughs> the hot door action. Yes, mm-hmm. Came in at the right time. What? Um, okay. So Luna's dead with a puncture wound to her neck, and it's the, the shit that, I don't know, kills you. I don't remember which one it is. One of those poisony thingies. We have to go back to the warehouse because we promised to meet up. Oh, the door is open. Everybody, uh, oh, Fi and I don't really want to go in, so Kay punches us, stuffs us in the door, and then we fall out of the other side. And then we go into the security room, and we have Luna's bracelet, but no Luna. So it's just me and Fi, and we're in this room. Yeah, it was that one, Jory. You got it. It's That was the drug. <laughs> You nailed it. It's whatever the fuck that one it was. Uh, we got some binders. Okay, we got some screens. Looks like a machine of some kind. Very, very deductive. You guys are regular detectives. All right, we got the thingy. We got some hexagons. Pretty sure they're just shelves. Triangles wedged in between the hexagon. Hmm. Can we not? Can we not push them like magical buttons? What does this do? Oh, is this a lion? What's it got in its mouth? Some kind of button. Looks like you can push it. You can barely make it out, but I think there's something carved on the surface. A sun? Wait, so is the lion eating the sun? Yeah, whatever. Right now we need to focus on getting out of here. I'm gonna push the button, that okay? Yeah, sure. Oh, the light's turned off. Guess it's a light switch. Whoa, this shelving unit got nope. Strange set of shelves. Check it out. They're all lit up. Yeah, pretty colorful. Do you think it's a hint? Maybe. Oh my god, that looks really cool. What else is in here? Oh, this one lights up too. Hourglass with red sand. Hourglass with yellow sand. Can't believe it. It's yet more lion boar. Yes. It's all... I really hope... Maybe that's the mystery we'll solve today. It's about the fucking... The fucking lion. Okay, they don't like it in the dark. Bunch of pansies. Um, about the lion eating the sun. All right, let's come back down here. Well, let's check out what do we got in here. Some doohickeys. We got nine switches. There's a little thunderbolt icon up there. My guess is a bunch of power switches. They're all red. Does that mean they're all off? Did you hear something? Yeah, I did. Kind of like a starting up sound. Well, let's, let's flip them all. Sounds like a great idea. Don't trust it, it's lion. Everything in this game is lion. It was always lion. It's a green chair. Oh, here we go. Cheeky, oh, security cameras, I thought so. What about Tenmyoji, Clover, and Quark? Can you see them anywhere? I, uh, you can see just as well as I can, there's nobody there. No Dio or K either. Well, these are all the old rooms. Why the fuck would you expect them to be in the old rooms? Oh yeah, that's right. Phi and Sigma didn't want to go through the white doors because Tenmyoji and Clover were missing and now they're dead. Look at those stars. It's all a Jewish Illuminati lizard people plot. Oh my goodness. I can't believe it's not Vor. Don't you mean butter? Um, nothing. There's nothing. So if that's all the old rooms and they aren't there, then what the fuck? Where do they end up? Got a big ass TV. Big ass blank TV. This turned on. No? Okay, we can't do anything with it. Wow, this is, I think this is the first room where we've gotten like, generally nothing to go off of here. We got a big ass speaker. Can we beep boop some buttons over here? Okay. Main console has a screen. 
that's not doing anything and well let me it won't let me beep boop fine I just have to believe in the heart of the cards but what if I don't though you know what everything in here is a little bit rainbow check out these stairs right now these are all the bracelet colors. What's going on in here? Oh my god, I hope I don't have to make color combinations for that shit. That was smashing. Spell, thank you for the host. I appreciate that. This has an 11 on it. There's an 11 carved into the top. I don't even know what that could mean. And then this one has a four. Ooh. A four and an 11. That's, that's all we've been given. Um. Okay, well, it's time to cheat already. That was quick. That that might be a new record, you guys. That legitimately might be a new record for me. I am, for some reason, currently extremely tired. Like, nothing happened today to make me this tired. I feel like I'm slowly going into a coma. Um, okay. Yeah, nine switches. Okay. The hourglasses. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh. We gotta explore a little bit more in the dark. That's what we're up to. We gotta explore a little bit more in the dark. No, fuck fucking hell. The dark. The dark. This <laughs> is don't Google say she. You'll get you'll get secrets you don't want to know. Just enjoy the ride. It's okay. I got this. All right. We got some codes. Um. All right. Well, I'm gonna write these down. Let's see how many froggies we can use today. Froggies to the rescue. All right. Ah <laughs> uh, yes, the password was ten. Tan, tan dato to beer. I still can't fucking say that to say it all. Your password, oh shit. God, if this was anybody's password, kudos to them because I cannot remember any of these. A D G B S G D Q N Y. Oh wait, we should probably be, this is the blue stair. This is the green stair. This is the yellow stair. Okay. No, I already need a new, a new, a new froggy. Can't believe Squid Squid is coming to New York. Tadeo at Irvir, Irvir. Ta, taddy, Tadio, Tadio at Evitir. Tadio at Evitir. Maybe I nailed that one. Tadio Elevator. It's just evolving even more. T-I-S-G is cyan. Uh, Z-Y-K-G-L-P-E is pink. And Jesus, T-M-J-Y-U-V-G-J -J is red. All right, I still don't know what to do with any of these. How about you guys have a discussion about it? Okay, no, you're just gonna read it to me. That's not helpful in the least. <laughs> what is it? Anything else glow in here? Anything else want to have a rave with me? Nope, just these. Well, um. Okay, we gotta turn the lights back on. We're done with that. Check the switches in the dark, you think? Oh, uh, that's a fucking lie. This walkthrough says we should be able to look at these. Okay. Oh, all right, it just turns on. <laughs> okay. Okay, we got a password that we gotta put in. T. M. J. Y. U. V. G. J. For the red chair. The red step goes with the red chair. Who the fuck designed that light switch? So gaudy. I have no idea. Okay. Uh, 
Okay, we did it. Uh, see that icon on the one in the upper left corner? Yeah. Touch it. I wonder what this icon means. There's only one way to find out, right? One of these. Alright, I get you. I get you. Oh, fuck. I only get that many touches? That's not enough touches. That's not enough touches! Spell, are you off? I hope you have a lovely sleep. Thank you for dropping in. Thank you for the host. I hope you have a good night. That's not enough touches. What? Two triangles in the middle. Then two middle hexagons. All right. Fuck that today. <laughs> today in particular. How do you like that puzzle? Uh, you got a new icon. Let's open this file. Look it up. Uh, the one over your. Oh. Will be me. What does that mean? What, what? Okay, I'm just gonna light this one up. What we got for the green password? <laughs> Screw it. ADGB. ADGB. Will I am? Will I am? Is that you? Is he dropping a hot new Black Eyed Peas song? You know, Black Eyed Peas hasn't made a song in a long time. That makes me sad. I didn't like that. Like that either. I almost made them all pink. I didn't actually cheat on that one. I just clicked shit. I'm sad about the, sad about the that lack of artistic output. What do you mean? All right, we got the thing. Wait, what? I clicked on it. Click harder. I was you. I was you will be me. All right, that doesn't make sense. Oh, you don't, you don't miss the Black Eyed Peas. I like their original stuff back in like, I don't know, the early 2000s, I guess. Um, their current stuff wasn't the best, but. Okay, well, now what? Uh, can we, wait, can we do this one? Yeah, yellow. Yellow, we're working with uh, S, G, D, Q, and Y. S, G, D, Q, and Y. Was that the game with the Latin in the water garden? What? Latin was too few ego eris. Yep, yeah. Oh, this one's got a different symbol. Uh, what does this one do? There is an icon. Click it. Touch and find out. Oh, God. Yeah, that looks right. What are we supposed to do here? Alright, this one has four. This one has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wow, it's really hard to read those. Um, oh, are these gonna be like? Hold on, hold on. No idea why that didn't work, Me either. Well, let's just. So one red equals one blue. This is not helpful. <laughs> you saw the light bulb turn on and then break. It's shattered.
Is it supposed to be time related? Oh, fucking hell. All right. You have to figure out how many seconds each hourglass can hold. I really should read the directions for these, but I just skipped through it and then I'm lost. <laughs> You already know the red and the yellow ones because you found the red and uh, hourglass in the cubby hole. It said four, and the yellow said eleven. It did. It did do that. So four is red, and eleven. I just broke my pencil. Is yellow. Okay. To figure out the others, tap the hourglass to turn them over. Press the play button to start the sand. All hourglasses will stop as soon as one of the hourglasses is empty. For example, if you flip over the red and the yellow and press play, the red one will become empty and the yellow one will have seven seconds in it because it stopped after the red. Four seconds became empty. So yeah, okay, this makes sense. So four and seven, this now has, it's split up into, or no, 11, sorry. Split up into four and seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can literally just count the bars though. And it's accurate. Okay, all right, hold on. So blue, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go with blue is seven. Let's just try this out because this would be stupid cheaty. Um, blue seven, right? And then we'll say green is Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Green is nine. Um, and pink is like a fuck ton. It'd be like nine, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. You sure they said about what? Wait, what to me or to me? I have a question. Can any of you move one part of the side of your nose up and down, um, but then can't move the other side of your nose, or is that just me? I can make like a weird scrunchy nose face, but only on one side. I can just do like some of that. Like that muscle I can tense, but not on the other side. I don't know if you guys can see what I'm doing at all, but I can't, there's no way to. But for some reason this face, I don't know what this is. It's just right there. Oh, that might be cr oh, God, I got cramped with my face. Okay, dokie. Uh, red is four. Blue is seven. Green is nine. Eleven and fifteen. Wow, you really could just count the bars if you really wanted to. Alrighty. <laughs> got it. <laughs> Not bad. There's another screen. Click the thing. Look. Look, the screen's changed. Okay, all right. We're supposed to shuffle them up. And we know, what do we know? No, don't put me in that yet. What the fuck, don't throw me into that. Hold on. Will be me. Will be me. And then, I was you. Our clues, all right. Um, okay, let's scramble them right, no, just do the thing. Oh my God, do I have to click on, wait, do I have to click on this maybe? Yeah, okay, that was weird. Um, okay, so the, obviously the period has to go last, right? And then will be, I was you, she knows everything will be me. Oh no, wait, there's two sentences in here. What if it's like some of this? I know Will was she be you every you everything me. Nope, that didn't work. Um, she knows everything. I was you. Will be me. Um. I was, will you be me? Mm. 
Has anyone ever been far? Has anyone really been far even as decided to use even go what want to do look more like? Mm. Mm hmm. No. Imagine how it's touched the sky. Don't open dead inside. Or what, what is that one? That's hold on. No, it's a different one. I'm thinking of a different one. Um, oh God, my brain's so broken today. It can't even meme. That's how you know it's bad. Can't even meme. I guess I shouldn't be surprised that I'm tired. Let me tell you guys a story. Let me tell you guys a story. Um, so this story is very intricate. Okay, just like bear with me. Like, just hold hold your questions till the end. All right. Recently learned that I am lactose intolerant, right? After like months of discomfort and pain and everything I eat like trying to kill me, I was like, what is happening? Cut out dairy and started taking lactase pills, magically fixed. It's not diagnosed by anybody, but I feel like a thousand times better, right? So I'm chalking it up to lactose intolerance. Last night, I learned that ranch is apparently a lactose product and I didn't know that. So I spent the night dying. <laughs> when this happens, I typically sleep either on the couch or the floor and I give Boggs the bed so that he's not disrupted by my constant like getting up all night, right? To die. Um, so that he can sleep and be able to work and not, you know, lose sleep over me. What is that story? Hold on, after I finish my story. Hold on, hold your thoughts. Um, anyway, so I was sleeping on the floor last night, right? Like, like the, the, it's like bed, floor, and then like my nightstand, right? And on my nightstand I had a cup of water. Um, and at around, I think, three in the morning. You like see it in movies all the time where somebody's sleeping and they get a splash in the face, like somebody, you know, wakes them up by throwing a bucket of water on them or something or whatever. But I've never realized how actually jarring it is to be woken up by water falling on you. In the middle of the night, I'm pretty sure it was Cappy knocked over the water that was on the nightstand onto like the back of my head, all down the back of my shirt, like multiple pillows, multiple blankets. Water everywhere, three in the morning. I like woke up screaming. I didn't know what was happening. Um, and that's probably why I'm so tired. <laughs> it's because I got watered on after having an already pretty shit night and like going to bed rather late. It all makes sense now, remembering that, why the tired has hit me. My body's like, I could only get you this far, man. I'm sorry. I haven't been tired the rest of the day, but okay, now well, let's. And it also woke Boggs up like in a panic because I woke up screaming, right? So he was like, oh my God, what's happening? <laughs> I felt really bad. <laughs> um, okay, you've got to be kidding me. I've been further even more decided to use even go need uh, to do look more as anyone can. Can you really be far even as decided half as much to use go wish for that? My guess is that when one really been far even as decided once to use even go one, it is then that he has to, he has really been far even as decided to use e even go want to do look more like. It's just common sense. My guess is that when one really go to wait, waits in expansion has entrance in deciding for which is real did it. I made it through all of that. And there's Dick Butt again. <laughs> Somehow I managed to bring that up. Thank you, hello. I'm sure, I'm sure I'll like sleep like a fucking log tonight and it'll be fine. And for anybody who's curious, ranch has lactose in it. The more you know. It, it didn't occur to me until I was like done eating and then I was like, wait a minute. I have a bad feeling. And then I was right. All right, who wants to solve this? Who wants to use their magical talk backwards skills to do this? I knows everything doesn't work. Use knows everything doesn't work. So it has to be she knows everything, right? 
You will be me. I was. No. You will. I will be me. You was. I will be. Was you me? I will. I was you, everything she knows will be me. Oh, all right, I was you. Everything, everything she, oh, everything has a period though. She, everything she knows will be me. No, nope, that didn't do it. Mira broke Morte, <laughs> thank you for the clip. <laughs> Wait a minute, retracts glass of milk. <laughs> yeah, mm-hmm. Um. Oh. Oh. Oh no. Oh no. These guys are idiots. We can't make all that a sentence. We gotta turn off some of these words. Some of these darn persnickety words. We don't need all these. We don't need all these. Duh. All right, she knows everything. Hold on, do the thing. Do the thing, my boy. Sigma. There we go. She knows everything. Where do these need to go for you to trigger things? Nothing? Okay. The bottom, apparently. <laughs> nice. All right. This is a thing. Uh, moon, moon, moons, and the sun, and the sun. Sigma is my large husbando. You're, you're claiming your husbando. Uh oh. Oh no. There they go. Bye. Okay. Um. Should we do like an I was you? Okay. Hold on. That would be everything but those three on. All right. Sigma has two hands? Oh my god, Sigma's like, my large hand. I mean, if you can share, yeah. Oh, fuck's sake. I don't know why I have to click on that in particular. What was it? I was you. Will be me. All right. All right, we did it. Fuck this room and it's weird puzzles. The screen changed. Oh, that's an awful color. All right, sun, 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 the triple sun. The triple sun. Do you think all the passwords are different? I haven't really been paying attention. They could just be the same in every room and I wouldn't even know. All right, we got sun, ooh, damn it, moon, sun, sun. Oh, the passwords are randomly generated every playthrough. That That's actually really smart. That makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. All right. Cl close it. Oh my God. <laughs> Apparently I do not have any patience today. We are learning slowly. Sun, sun, sun. That was a four froggy room. No, I can't count. Three, ro three froggy room. Oh, just the key cards and the key. All right, that, that, there's nothing fun. No secrets, no, no secret keys. Okay, all right, I get it. I get it, get out of here. Um, this door. There's a meme about not needing to only hold hands with one person. Never seen this meme. I really can't meme today, apparently. Wait. I just realized what? something. <laughs> yeah, what's when that? When we were looking at the security footage earlier, we were just looking for live feeds. We were trying to figure out where the others are, what mm -hmm. they were up to, if they were alive, and so on. But yep. we totally forgot that security systems like this can do more than show you live footage. 
Ooh, what kind Are of secrets are we going to get about the past? We're talking about stuff that's been recorded. Footage of the past. If they store that, we might yeah. be able to see Don't know it. how much luck we'll have, but it's worth a shot. Let's do it. Clickety-clackety over there. What do we Leave do? that to me. Yeah, you clickety-clackety. That's fine. You know well, how to use this thing? designed so that a human could operate it. That means there's a logic to how it's set up. Not always. It's all a simulation. Oh a my god, we're computes, actually in the Matrix. A calculator calculates, and an automobile mobiles. I don't think I've ever thought about mobiles as a verb. Everything's designed to do something. It mobiles. And once you know what, you can start guessing how. Once you start to figure out how to get it to do things, it's just a question of playing with it until it does the things you want it to. This is true. See? But I usually break it beyond all, all fucking comprehension. Um, looks like this is it. Good work. Knock it off. Okay. Makes it sound like you're better than me or something. Alrighty. That's how you discover masturbation. Uh huh. Wow. Okay. All the delete is data. Uh, all the all the delete is data. Mhm. Mm all the data is deleted. Everything says no data. Hmm. Panic. Uh, let's check the log. Damn it. This isn't good. Looks no, like all the video data no was removed before we got here. No answers for me today. That all the delete is guess. data. <laughs> all it says here is administrator. So zero. Well, that's a little frustrating. Ooh, that footage could have told us a lot. Yeah, like yeah. who killed the other people. It might have given us what we need to figure out who the killer is, too. Who did that other thing? The camera in room two in the crew quarters would have recorded what happened to Alice and Luna. Mm -hmm. Same for the old woman in the warehouse. Mm -hmm. And if there was a recording of us being carried into the AB rooms, we could have even figured out who Zero Senior Ten is. OG, zero, Phi Sigma, Luna, Alice. Mm. That individual. Correct. Want to open it? You left out Dio. Wait, did you put it Dio says, in there? Gollum status. I don't think so. Oh, the Gollum is dead. Should be the system logs for the robots. I told you about them in the pantry, remember? Dio is yeah. dead forever. You mean but he's the not room dead. full of robots on the other side of the green door? Yeah. I just predicted what that text there would say. There we go. Shoot. Wait, 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 wait. Looks like it. Wait, 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 wait. Where's our boy? Where's our boy Gollum? Oh, this one says boy. I'm pretty sure this one's K. This one right here, that's fucking K. Mm-hmm. Yep. Calling it. No, none of those are our boy. Guess there isn't anything we can. What is a it? Second. There's a scroll bar. Try scrolling. There he is! That's him! I knew it! The golem we met is still functional. What do you mean? I thought you told me Gollum, or whatever his name was, Gollum lives. started spitting smoke and keeled over. Gollum lives! Yeah, but he said that was his... what passes for Gollum's brain, I guess, was in the main computer. Only his body was disabled. His brain was probably still functioning. Can we see you? Already logs? on it. Here you are. Hmm, try the one that says cash. These file names are just random characters. Whatever, just pick one and open sure. it, I guess. This is. Okay, that's when Kate punched us. Yeah, that's what I thought. It's probably from right after Kate decked us. We'll be tossed in the uh, room thing. Just watch it. <laughs> oh my god, he drug me by my foot? What a dick! <laughs> Interesting. This is the footage the Gollum pulled from the main server. This took me by my fucking foot. The original data was deleted, but it looks like the stuff he pulled is still here. <laughs> I knew you could take it, apparently. Me and my bodysuit. So, if we go back through these files... Yeah. 
We might be able to figure out who the killer is, maybe even who Zero Senior is. Nice. Great work, Sigma. Let's, let's, let's like, less talking and more opening before somebody gets wise and starts deleting these fucking files. It's not like I'm really doing anything. Just open them. Just open them all at the same time. We start going through the rest of the files. Security footage showed Kay and Dio clearly passing through the white door on the far right. Good. Looks like they're both fine. <laughs> I just leave Senmyoji Co Clover and Quark. I opened my mouth to continue and then it happened. Oh god. My vision suddenly blurred and shaking my head did nothing to clear it. Are we hitting a story check? This is what it, this is what it looks to have a story. This is what it looks like to have a story check. I staggered, my balance gone. Oh no! <gasps> we have Radical Six! Oh, what? Why is she talking like that? This is what it's like. This is what it's like for everything else in the world to go faster than you do. <laughs> Guys, it's just like that chat. Paladin, can you read this one? <laughs> uh, you really don't look so good. Your skin is, is all pale. Maybe you should sit down for a minute. She sounds like somebody's playing a tape of her voice all sped up. What is going on here? I can't understand what she's saying. Come on, say something. Are you there? Your eyes look kind of blank. And why is she moving so fast? It's like watching a video on Fast Forward. What the hell is... Wait, could it be me? Maybe my brain is slowed down or something, so it just looks like everything is speeding up. Hey. hey, Sigma, what the heck is up with you? You look like... You look... You look... Something... What is up with you? Look. Hold on. There's a sofa over there. Why don't you lie down for a bit? Wow, that broke me. Find the chipmunk. I still couldn't make out what she was saying, so I nodded weakly, my eyes drifting shut as I tried to sort out what was happening to me. God, that would be such a weird feeling. Uh, I woke up several minutes later. When I opened my eyes, the first thing I saw was the ceiling of the security office. I sat up slowly, rubbing, rubbing, my ten rubbing tenderly at my head. Phi, who had been sitting in front of the monitors, stood up and walked over to me as soon as she heard me move. Sounds normal. You okay? Her voice sounded normal again. She wasn't moving strangely either. Whatever had happened, whatever had been happening seemed to have stopped. Let out a quiet sigh of relief. Yeah, I'm fine. Don't worry you about sure? it. You sure? That's yeah. good. You really looked like you'd lost it for a minute there. Do we not need to tell her that we might become crazily suicidal? Hooked on phonics? Thank you, Jora. <laughs> I never learned my phonics. Uh, I seem to have found it again. Uh, this is the security office. Maybe they've got a lot of Your sanity is pretty easy to miss. I'm surprised anyone found it, let alone turned it in. <laughs> well, looks like I don't have anything to worry about. Yeah, I think I must just be getting tired. Kind of surprised I didn't catch up. It didn't ca catch up to me sooner. Okay, I'm trying to think. Maybe in this timeline they don't know about Radical Six? Um, Zora might not have access to that chat in Discord. Um, I think I have to give him a special role. Hold on. Um, where are you? Um, <laughs> is Black does Black still have the role people with crabs? <laughs> okay, there. Oh, say she posted it. Oh, well, never mind then. Um, <laughs> I, I hope so. Wait, let's find Blecko. Let's find Blecko and see if he has people with crabs. Um, God, what is his name in here? What is anybody's name in anywhere? Uh, AJ, I see you in the Pokemon chats. There it is. It's just, oh, it's oh, it's Blecko with a B. He doesn't have crabs. Damn. No more crabs for Blecko. He's crab free. Um, I'm getting kind of tired. Kind of surprised I didn't catch I up with I hope that's sooner. all it is. You haven't... 
caught a disease or something, have you? Mm, no. Nope. For just a moment, I thought of Radical Six, but I didn't want to worry Five. I didn't have to. Better to stay quiet about it. Well, you're looking a lot better, so Why, she I can would stop definitely worrying, come to that conclusion. Right? 100%. Fine. Sorry, my mom. No more check ins. Anyway, I figured something out while you were resting. Come have a look at this. What you got? <laughs> what is Footage this? Footage from room two in the crew quarters. Oh, yes. Here the we go. The room where we found Alice and Luna. I dug it out of Gollum's cache. <laughs> when was we'll it see recorded? in a minute. Up there on the right, it looks like some sort of Can time you figure code. it out? Four, two, something. No. It's just a bunch of numbers. I can't make heads or tails yeah. of it. The central server seems to be using its own time system. Is it appropriate to clip that too? What? The people with crabs thing? Files appear to be Clip named based on that system. I don't care. They might as well be random to you and me, which made it pretty Everybody hard to knows find Blanco this gem. <laughs> Kay. Oh, yeah. it's Kay. Looks, he looks at his bracelet here, probably checking how much time is left. I'll just pause that and magnify it. 21. 21 minutes. So that means this footage is from 21 minutes before the primary door is opened, right? Enhance! Zoom! Exactly. <laughs> Sharpen! Enhance! <laughs> oh my god. That would have been the white doors in this case, right? Yes. After Kay leaves this room, it's about two minutes before he comes back with you and me. Okay. For 20 minutes on the clock when we met up with him, right? So that means we're seeing he, what we're seeing here is K one minute before he saw right. us. Right. He doesn't have crabs. Thank you for the clip, Jora. Enlarge! No, 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 that's not how it works. It means this is right after he tried to yeah, resuscitate Yeah, if you Luna. believe him. The footage here doesn't show any of that. Are there any other angles? I looked around, but I couldn't find one. The only Just stuff stuff. left is shot from this position. Even so, I think we've gotten our hands on something important. You mean that this is a record of what happened right around the time of Luna's death, right? I think everybody's dead. Like, er, not everybody's dead, Jesus. Exactly. Everybody's a murderer. Everybody's a murderer. Everybody's killing everybody. Are you ready? I have radicals okay. right now, apparently. Let's keep going. What else I'll move got? back to the start of this file so we can see it in chronological order. Let's say this is zero hours, zero minutes. After all, not nine days, it's not like nine we know hours, what time it actually is. Right. So, this is the start of our footage. There's no one here. Yeah. About a minute goes by before anyone shows up. Wait. How do you know it's been a minute? This. Oh, that's one of the hourglasses we used earlier. Oh. Yeah. If I play it back at normal speed, I can measure time using this hourglass. Mm -hmm. Then I just add the time from the hourglass, and that's how far in we are. Huh. I feel like an hourglass would be a very uh, loose way of telling time. Somebody's coming in. Luna, is that Clover behind her? Yeah. This is zero hours, one minute. Right now, you and I are talking to Dio in the Floor B warehouse. With the time frame we've established, it. Got it. calculating what we're doing is pretty easy. It. What's going on? Are they fighting? Probably. No, it's not really a fight. It looks like Clover's just going off on Luna. Clover's a whack job. Luna's just staying silent and listening to her. Yeah. Can we hear them? No. There's no audio. Wanna of course there's it? no audio. What the hell is this? Let's dial up internet right there. That's what that the is. The audio data must have been transcoded into something else. Well, we won't be able to understand anything in that. Not today. Seen enough? I'm going to fast forward a little bit. Clover's interrogation goes on for a while, but it's all pretty much the same thing. 
Now, at zero hours, ten minutes, things suddenly change. Here. Hey, they're gone. Were they just poof? As I watched, Clover moved steadily to closer to Luna, who backed away almost as if she were frightened. So, Clover killed Luna. Clover continued her advance until she disappeared below the bottom edge of the screen. Uh, is there another? Uh, no, you said this was it. Yeah, this is the only one that I found. Shouldn't be too hard to guess what happened after you've seen the next part, though. Clover, leave alone. Yup. Clover left. She looked like she was kind of panicking. Yeah. This is about a this, minute and 40 seconds after they both left the frame. This is not surprising. So zero hours, 11 minutes, 40 seconds. She's a crazy bitch. Only Clover left. Luna's still in there. Luna's still in the room. That Hold means... On. She's Wait until you see dead. the whole thing before you start deducing. Okay. At zero hours, 12 minutes, another person comes in just missing her. Fucking Dio. Of course, fucking Dio. He's disappeared too. Down below the bottom of the frame. What's he up to? I don't know. But I'm pretty sure that whatever it was, he doesn't Here want us to know about it. Here comes the dick butt. <laughs> Remember what he said when you asked him about Quark? How the fuck would I know? I've been here. Hmm. <laughs> well, I mean, I, I, oh my god, are we shocked that Dio lied? He wasn't in floor B the whole time? He went to the crew corners after we left him? What? What a twist of events. Yeah. So what would have been important enough for him to lie about it? We should consider that Literally it might have anything. been something bad. God, Dio would sneeze and then lie and say he didn't do it. Whatever it was, it, uh, it happened during this time. Yeah, I think so. All right, now he's left. And it looks like he left in a hurry. Maybe he heard a noise. Like the what? cyan door opening? Now, ten seconds after Dio leaves, a fourth person shows up. Kay. That brings us to zero hours, 13 minutes, 10 seconds. Okay. It's K. Uh, when he heard K open the cyan door, he panicked. Whatever he's up to, he didn't want K to catch him. He was like that shitty kid we all knew that would do something in front of you and then say they didn't do it. A hundred percent. A hundred percent. He also reminds me of, and this is going to sound really weird, I have this journal that I wrote in like kindergarten preschool right and it's like the worst illegible letters you could possibly like the terrible spelling like it's total shit right but my little kid ass wrote this story about this guy i think his name was like Ty tyrone or something like that wrote this story about this kid and i remember specific i even remember feeling angry about this this kid was adamant about the fact that he was born in a block of ice and in my journal, I was just like writing, I was like, he's so stupid, you can't, babies can't survive in ice. Like, I can't believe he would lie to my face about something like that. And I was just like livid that this kid was so convinced that he was born in a block of ice. <laughs> anyway, the point of the story is that seems like something Dio would do. Where Dio would be like, I was born, I, I was born in a block of ice. I have a son. I am a circus ringleader. It's all very true. You can believe me. Um, yeah, that sounds like <laughs> that sounds like something Dio would do. Ice child. I don't know. I don't know what would like in a kid's mind. What would make them want to be like? I was born in a block of ice. I, I remember him thinking like it was like the coolest shit ever. Like he was almost bragging about it. And I was like, this kid's so dumb. Like what? He's so stupid. <laughs> And then K disappears too. Sounds like the kid's parents didn't want to explain how they were made. You know what? That's a good point. Maybe, maybe that's it. They sat him down. They said, Tyrone, Tyrone, honey, you were brought to us from the ice stork. 
We chipped you out of a block of ice and you became our child. <laughs> that is how all babies are born. That's what happened. <laughs> I mean, born, being born in a block of ice would be pretty cool. You'd still be dead. Not, not every child comes from a block of ice. No, say she, it's, it's the ice stork. It's just a cold, cold lie. Oh my God. We definitely brought you from the Mayfield. Yep, you came straight off the boat. <laughs> totally no lies. No lies, not hide. 10, 100% 10, truth. 100%. 100%. Uh, okay, disappears too. Um, yeah, below the bottom of the frame, just if like the he others. he was telling the truth, this is where he begins to try and resuscitate Luna. Okay. Anyway, nothing happens for the next 16 minutes. It's just this. So I'll fast forward, all right? <laughs> mm-hmm, yeah. Clicky, clicky, clacky. All right, clacky. Okay, you should see something you recognize in a minute here. Us come in, K leave. Oh yeah, K with the 21, okay. Yeah. We're back to 21 minutes before the primary doors open. For our arbitrary time code, that's zero hours and 29 minutes. One minute later, at zero hours, 30 minutes, K heads to the floor A warehouse. Once he gets there, he tells us about Luna's death. So Kay wasn't lying. That's all the footage I wanted to show you. I've looked at it carefully, and I think it has something to tell us. <laughs> you mean who killed Luna, well, right? Well, I can't say for sure. This footage makes for pretty shaky evidence, but it does suggest a very likely culprit. Who do you think it is? I ran over the footage in my head. Zero hours, one minute. Clover and Luna enter the room. So... It has to be Clover. All the footage she wanted to show. Oh, Squid, good point. She could be up to something. The Mayflower. Oh yeah, not the Mayfield. The Mayflower, that's the ship. Mm-hmm. You remember the part where I said I was tired? <laughs> that's not an excuse. I would do that on a normal day, let's be real. And I think Kay is the killer, uh, the only exception being Dick Butt Dio. I don't think K is the killer either. I think it's K. I think it was probably Clover because A, what reason would Clover have for bringing Luna here if it wasn't to shove Alice's, Alice is dead in this room right now. So if it wasn't to like be like, you killed my friend, me, 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 like she does. Um, she would bring her specifically here and nowhere else to murder her so that she could be like, you did this and then kill her. Also, Clover leaves. If Luna was just like knocked out or, you know, she didn't have any blood on her at all though. It was literally like one wound and down. She would like, you know, crawl somewhere, try to leave the room at least a little bit, like maybe flop a hand somewhere, none of that. So I think she's just dead after Clover and then everybody else, Dio must have like wanted something out of her pockets or stolen her bracelet. I don't remember if her bracelet was there even. Dio wanted something else. Has Dio killed anybody? He said he killed the old lady, but we don't actually know if that's true anymore. I don't know that Dio's actually murdered anybody. Maybe he just doesn't have it in him. He'll lie all day, but he won't murder. <laughs> 10 minutes, they both move out of frame. 11.40, Clover exits. 12, Dio enters. Dio immediately exits frame. Uh, it seemed like likely that Dio was up to no good during this period. Dio exits. K enters. K claims that he tried to resuscitate her for like fucking forever, so I feel like that's all he's doing. Dio wanted to join the circus. No, 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 he's already the circus ringleader, remember? According to his outfit and his lies. Uh, okay, and then K looks at his bracelet. There seems to be only one conclusion. The person who killed Luna is, oh my God, we get to choose. Oh, but it doesn't branch? Oh. Oh, it was Clover. What Clover. makes you think so? Luna could still have been alive after Clover left the room. Dio and Kay both went into the room after Clover. Either of them could have killed Luna too. The footage alone isn't enough to tell us who the killer is. But if we take one thing into account, then the case against Clover gets and a lot stronger. what is that element? Dio's behavior at the hmm. white doors. K 
Kay wanted us to enter the white doors. I told him I wouldn't leave all three people to die. Do you remember what Dio said? Use your fucking head for once. You're gonna get us killed. He obviously knew that only you and I would be going through the door. Yeah. Don't you get it? He knew we had Luna's bracelet, which means he also knew Luna was dead. Is that what you're getting at? Exactly. If he didn't know she was already dead, he would have never said that. Wait, was this not... Oh my god, my brain is getting so confused. This wasn't one of the endings where we all went and stared at dead Luna and dead Alice in the room and like had a conversation about it? Okay, cool. It's fine. I guess we didn't do that. Um... The moment Kay suggested we go through the doors, he would have brought it up. That's impossible. How are they supposed to get through without Luna? But he didn't even mention her. Like, he didn't expect her to be there. Why would he do that? I can only think of two reasons. One, that when Dio entered the room, Luna was already dead. Or two, he killed Luna himself. We only know that through future vision. That's how future vision works. It comes out of your brain like that, and then it sucks back in. It, like, grabs the info, plucks it out of another timeline straight into your noggin. Luna just had too much of that. Oh, fuck me. That thing. Second one doesn't seem likely, though. If Dio had killed Luna, he probably would have made it a point to hide that. I'm guessing he probably would have asked where she was. It's true. Where's Luna? Sigmund Phi won't be able to get through the white doors without her. He seems like the kind who, a kind of guy who would go out of his way to feign ignorance of a crime he committed. Tadio! I can do Tadio. I can do Tadio, because that sounds like tater. <laughs> um, so if Dio would go out of his way to cover up a crime he committed, what the hell reason would he have for admitting that he killed the old lady? Tadio. Tay. Dio? Dio. Dio is the killer. Correct. Uh, that doesn't clear him, of course, but it does make it a lot less likely that he was the killer. If he wasn't the killer, then we're left with only one other option. When Dio entered the room, Luna was already dead. Yeah, that's how I see it. You guys are not... They're really not taking into consideration motive. Like, you have to think about the motive. Dio would ha has, like, no fucking reason to want to kill Luna. Al uh, Clover, who thinks she probably killed Alice, has every reason to want to kill her, and she's a crazy bitch. And we know this from the previous games. I mean, obviously, they can't they can't see that far into the past, That's but... That's pretty much what I thought, Clover. too. And it does seem like Clover had a motive. There we go. You mean what Alice yes. noticed? The movement of the AB rooms convinced Alice that Luna had killed the old woman. Once Clover realized that, she probably started to think that Luna had killed Alice to keep her from telling anyone else the truth. There we go. She probably led Luna to the crew quarters to confront her. Past vision not included. That's a separate purchase. Maybe she hoped seeing Alice's corpse would cause Luna to confess. Maybe she knew something we don't. But Clover didn't get what she wanted. Luna didn't confess. Then, during her interrogation, something happened. It's hard to say what. Luna might have said something that set Clover off. Or, maybe she admitted to a crime she didn't commit just to get Clover to stop. Whatever it was, something happened that drove Clover to murder. When did Clover get the injection gun? I would guess after she went through the yellow door, she would have been exploring the infirmary with Alice and Kay. That seems the most likely place to find it. She cray. She's super cray. She's extra anyway, cray. This is all just a theory, right? Jora, Jora, you never saw 999, right? If I remember right, you're the one that hasn't seen 999. Um, in 999, one of my favorite endings is one where Clover thinks her brother is dead and takes an axe and murders everybody. Everybody. She goes literal psycho. So... That's how I know she's crazy. Dio has three letters. Dio is letter f D is letter four, I is letter nine, O is letter 15. Put them all together, you get 10. 10 has three letters again. Half-Life 3 confirmed! What? <laughs> 
Paladin, have you ever seen Black Dynamite? That whole thing reminded me of the... When they go from, like, M&M's to fucking Anaconda Malt Liquor gives you a... What is it? A Little Johnson? It's like the best, best version of that I've ever seen in my life. There's always flawless logic here. Yep. Mm -hmm. Holy fuck. <laughs> uh, it's all just a theory. You don't have any theory. proof, so yeah. keep it quiet, okay? <laughs> I mean, she allegedly because we went through the white doors and Clover didn't. She's dead. So, what does it matter? There's one last thing. Was there any footage that showed anything? No, nothing to tell us where Clover, Tenmyoji, and Quark went, and nothing about the old woman or Alice's murders either. <laughs> So, Zero Senior's identity. Okay, cool. We'll, we'll do it later. Okay, let's go find Clover. I guess we're not going to know the truth unless we get it straight from the horse's mouth. Am I confused here in remembering that she's I probably if dead? Clover's even alive. Okay, alright, okay. Um, I'm not doing so bad from reading across the room. My cat wanted to lay on my face. Aww. How sweet. Uh, she has to be... I sure hope so. She Oh, she has to be, like, alive is what... She has to be. I demand it because I want answers. Sigma, you're so whiny today. What's the matter? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because I have radical sex and I'm gonna murder everyone. Was there ever an iteration where... Where... Quark tried to kill other people? I think he always just wanted to off himself. I think that's all it was. Hot door action for you right there. My lips are like the most chapped out of anything my lips have ever been in the world. Wow, congratulations on that sentence, Miro. It's a real fucking winner right there. Yeah. No one's here. All right, let's start looking. We'll go through the crew quarters and work our way toward the elevator. You haven't seen Black Dynamite. Was trying to pull more uh, from the pitch perfect 237-911 theory. Oh, I don't remember enough about pitch perfect. Um. Hold on. Oh, well, okay. First of all, first of all, I highly, highly recommend, here, Paladin, I'll trade you. I highly recommend Black Dynamite. Funny fucking movie. And it's on um, Netflix right now. What in the world? This is a theory about the movie? Okay, I will have to dive, dive into that rabbit hole later um it's a long video but it's amazing oh my god yes i will be there for that um the video i just sent you though is the scene i'm talking about in black dynamite where they go they literally go from like m and m down this weird fucking string of things that are semi-connected to like the plot of the movie basically i anyway um highly recommend that movie to anybody that likes like just stupid humor uh, we go through the cool quarters and work our way Got towards it. the elevator. Yeah. Black Dynamite does shit like, in one scene, the, the, the mic boom comes down and hits the actor in the head and he like looks at it and it's done 100% on purpose, but it, it's just done to like, for like comedic effect. Oh God, it's just, it's the best kind of humor for me for some reason. That and like the scary movie humor. You search Fucking rooms best. one and two. I'll take three and four. Okay. One and two. It's all me. Got it. What about two? What's two got going on? Look at that hot door action. We're getting so much of it right now. Alice is still dead. Luna is still dead. The most horrible thing about death is how it turns a person into a thing. It's a thing uh, that looks like your friend, but it's not them anymore. Just a strange, cold shell. And every time you look at it, you feel a little 
of the coldness creeping in around the edges of your soul. Jesus! Why is it that every time somebody dies, Sigma gets like really fucking poetic? Scary movie humor is amazing. Yes. Yes. Seeing death puts a heavy ball of lead in your stomach and just sits there poisoning you. I turned and left the room. No good. There's no one in three or four. What about yours? <laughs> just the dead bodies. Nobody in them except Alice and Luna. Lead ball pressed against the inside of my abdomen. I leaned back against the wall and let out a long, What's weary wrong? sigh. Whoa, she got real close. Back the fuck up. You need to get it together. What are okay. we doing right now? <laughs> Looking right. for the others? The video is someone saying a theory that they have about the movie. Okay. All right. Say she. Paladin's Link. Yes. Is some YouTuber who has a crazy theory about the movie Pitch Perfect as a whole. My Link is the movie Black Dynamite, where in the movie they have a theory. There, I clarified. I, I, I know how it. you feel, but sitting around being hey, miserable. Hey, Fat isn't Knuckle, help welcome. Anybody. How are you? Hello, hello. Let's go. Why are you so close to my face? You're still confused? How can you still be confused? Which link did you click on? This workout is mocking the crap out of you? Psh, fat knuckle, you can beat the workout. What are you talking about? If I turned and headed for the door on the far end, I heaved myself up off the wall and followed. Do it, just do it, fat knuckle. Do the cardio. The fattest of knuckles. I'm not looking up the 9-11 one, it hurts my head. It's totally fair. I don't like this. I don't like this. This is usually before there's like a pop. Yeah, there it is. Mm-hmm. What the fuck happened here? She has one bloody finger. Somebody's bracelet's over there. He's kind of bloody. Did she stab him with her finger? That's what happened. You got two more ab workouts than 30 minutes of cardio. You're worn out. Nah, you got this. <laughs> You can do it! There's your motivation. <laughs> I decided to just go to bed instead of working out. That's my plan. Fingers are always the best weapon for stabbing. Okay, well this doesn't really solve uh, where Quark is, but it does help. We found two people. Where's her bracelet? First thing I felt was a strange cold sweat of terror. My stomach clenched in protest, pushing a wave of bile and nausea up into my throat. The lead ball turned into ice, and my legs began to tremble under the weight before uh, they finally gave way and collapsed. They were dead. What the fuck? It's not like we didn't already know they were gonna die. You don't go through the door on time. You die. We were supposed to find dead bodies. I don't understand why this is a shock. I could feel the movement uh, the moment I looked at them, but I didn't want to believe it. I couldn't, they couldn't be dead. Perhaps, perhaps they were just sleeping. Oh, they're just taking a nap. The cool feel of their skin under my shaking fingers dashed any hope I had left. Seishi, that is the million dollar question. How the fuck is Junpei old as shit while Clover's over here rocking a 21 year old bod? My, my, yeah, that's my main, my main idea, Paladin, is the cryogenic pods. That's my main theory. But there were three people in the pod, so who the fuck was the third person? The mystery deepens. I wrapped a trembling hand around the end of the bed and hauled myself up onto it. Even as I closed my eyes, I could still see them. My heart hammered away in my ribs and my chest felt so tight I could barely breathe. I forced myself to take long, deep breaths. I like how... Every time Sigma sees a dead body, he like hyperventilates and falls over and like dies. When Dio sees a dead body, he's like, oh, and trifles through the pockets. When uh, K sees a dead body, he's like, maybe I can resuscitate them with my hands <laughs> and tries to bring them back to life. Any but anytime Sigma, he's just like, eh, 
and then falls over like a fainting goat. Fuck abs, I'm doing cardio. I've been here for two hours. Two hours? Fuck, can't you like work out a little bit tomorrow too? Just like postpone some of that. Just transfer to a different body. There you go. There's the pro move right there. All right. Um, I forced myself to take long deep breaths. Finally, I opened my eyes. They were in a blind spot. <laughs> the what? security camera. Remember how we didn't see anything in the real time feed in the security room? Mm hmm. Yeah. Yep. Uh, I guess that partition yeah. was in the way. They're handcuffed together. Yeah. Whoever did this really didn't want them going anywhere. The chain's been looped around the pipe below the sink. They would have been trapped here when the doors closed. Look, Why? see the red marks on their wrists? They were trying to get the handcuffs off. So you're saying it wasn't one of them that did this. You're my only motivation. Do it tomorrow. I'm terrible motivation. Don't bank off me. Remember that whole bodybuilding competition thing? I basically have to live in the gym for the next five months. Oh, there's like an end goal. Well, then you should be in the gym at least six hours a day. When I did gymnastics, let's see, I was in the gym from like six to nine on weeknights, four days a week. Hold on. It was like Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. It was like Monday, Wednesday, hours and then Saturday Saturday was like I think Saturdays were 9 a.m. to 6 p.m. no that seems too long 11 a.m. to 6 p.m. we'll say it was like a good seven hours yeah so three nine so 16 hours should be in the gym for at least 16 hours. You have two kids and three jobs, so 16 hours. Don't you get back pay though now, Fat Knuckle? I'm pretty sure you get back pay now. The real pros go for nine days a week? Holy shit. Super pro. Uh, Probably was one of them not. that did this. There's a cut in Tenmyoji's left hand. It looks like he's probably from a knife or something similar. It must have been and deep. And the blood on his clothes probably came from that wound. Oh, it's Dio. So here's what happened. Clover, okay. Luna did something shifty. Clover killed Luna. Dio came in and took the knife out of Alice. That's what he was up to. Dio came in, took the knife out of Alice, stabbed Tenmyoji, and did this to them. <laughs> you joke, Seishi. Oh, man. But you can do two a day. That's true. That's so true. But the back pay doesn't pay the mortgage. That's true. No, that is true. Our mortgage company said fuck off when we asked for deferment. Wow, that's really shitty. Uh, can you put a mortgage payment on a credit card? I'm not enough of an adult to know how to handle any of that. Because Dio was in love with Luna? You think. I don't know why else he would take the rap for killing the old lady unless there was something between them, right, Cookie? I don't mean hours in a week, I mean days in a week. Literally nine days a week. The whole day. You have to count the whole day, too. I don't see any others, at least. Okay, if this so that's was the only, the only one, it doesn't look fatal. I don't think he died from this cut. The penalty. When the primary doors closed, they couldn't get them off. The needles and the bracelets activated. Yeah. And... You can see the marks on their wrists from where they were injected. The tubicurine must have killed them. Hmm. What what I asked, do you think that's why they were handcuffed into the thing? They wouldn't sink? have been able to get through the white doors without Quark. Hold on, who the fuck had handcuffs? Where did somebody get handcuffs? 458 days a year. Oh my god. Oh man, Fat Knuckle, I am so sorry. I am very sorry. I am not a fan of anything that's happening in this country right now. Um, but we're not gonna talk politics. 
the white Someone doors. wanted okay. to use the penalty to kill them. They didn't need to tie them up. <laughs> yeah, you've got a point. Hmm. What's I take wrong? back what I just said. Did you find yeah. something? Quark's hat in the sink. Oh, wait a minute. If I bent down and picked something up and handed it to me, it was Quark's. Correct. It has nine BP, too. Oh. There's no mistake. What's Quark's bracelet doing here? Wait, no, hold on. If Quark's bracelet is here, then that means... Your heart stops. Your bracelet comes off. Yeah, let's be happy. I smile and keep the family a beat. It's okay, Fat Knuckle. We're all here for you. We smile for you. There's some dick cutting onions. Yes, exactly. It's just raining in your gym. Oh, yep. Mm -hmm. Just raining indoors. You know, as it does. It's it's normal. Cookie agrees the Dio is in love with Luna. Is that are we shipping them right now? Is that what we're thinking? Uh so Quark said, this can't be happening. Hey, Not Sid, Quark. Calm down. Oh Just God. because his bracelet's off doesn't mean Quark's dead. <laughs> Probably. In fact, this could be good news. A ray of hope. A ray of yeah, hope? If Quark still had his bracelet on, then he would have ended up like Tenmi OG and Clover. But he's not wearing it. That means he might have managed to avoid getting injected with tuba curarine. Like, what off Quark's hand? That'd do it. I mean, nobody, nobody's really tried, so we're obviously not that desperate yet. I mean, the bracelet came off before the yeah. doors closed? That's impossible. Zero Junior told us that they only come off when your heart stops or when you Maybe escape. Maybe he got out then. Right, he's got 9 VP. Wait, so you're trying to say he escaped and then came back and left his bracelet here? No, that's impossible too. Zero Junior said that the number nine door only opens once. Even if he was able to get outside, he Why couldn't come back in. Why do you have to in. be so pessimistic? We're just playing by the rules. Have you actually seen Quark dead? Huh? Where's my girl Lotus? Uh, you mean Alice? She's dead. The new Lotus is Alice and she's dead. Everyone is dead. <laughs> That's why I'm so pessimistic. You need to think positive, Sigma. Reality no. is what we believe it to be. N this is not time for Schrodinger's fucking box. They're all dead. So you're saying this is what we wanted to happen. Oh That's my God. enough. Get off me, lady. Quark is definitely alive. Go he find has him to then. Be. Go find his he fucking has body. To be. I refuse to believe he isn't. Go bring that child to my face and tell me he's alive. I can't let an innocent kid like that get killed. I don't think he's innocent though. I really don't. I think he's up to some shifty shifty stuff. Although he did fucking regale us about a root beer for like 20 minutes which is something only a child would do uh i wanted to ask if she meant clover and ten Miyoji weren't innocent and had deserved to die but i swallowed my words fighting wasn't going to help us okay i'm positive everyone is dead mm -hmm, yeah he gave him a root beer float so it's fair play yeah he got a root beer float he died happy Feckin? What is Feckin? Feckin? What country does that come from? I'm American as balls. All, all we could do, all I could do was hope that Fi was right. Perhaps Quark was still alive. He's dead. He's so dead. Everybody's dead. What are you Examining doing? their bodies. Ten Miyoji first. Clues. Why? What kind of clues? To who might have killed them? Finding Quark's bracelet tells us something. I really think the only question we should be asking here is who the fuck had handcuffs, and where did they come from? If the killers saw it, that would make for an obvious motive. The Quark's bracelet, Clover and Tenmyoji would have been able to go through the white doors. The killer handcuffed them to the sink right. to prevent that. Right. That's my guess, at least. It's Dio. It's Dio. That's Dio odd. did it. Dio did it. You have Irish friends that use it in place of fucking. Feckin'? Interesting. A new F word for me to play with. That's odd. I What's can't wrong? find anything. I should have found something. You remember when we ran into Tenmyoji in the rec room? He sprayed our wrists with luminol. Mm -hmm. I'm sure I saw him pull the spray bottle out of his pocket. Okay. Okay, there's a lot to address in that sentence. There's a lot to address in that sentence. Boys, 
I know your pockets are bigger than girl pockets, so can somebody tell me, uh, have you ever been able to fit a full squirt bottle in your pocket? Please, please tell me. We already told you they must have had the cuffs in their prison pocket. It's not about where they stored the cuffs, it's where they got them from. I haven't seen handcuffs in all, in any of the rooms in this game. Not usually that big. Yes, Squid, you have put a full squirt bottle in a pocket. I've seen somebody put like a full bottle of wine in cargo pants before, I suppose. But like, those were cargo pants. I don't think, I don't think Ten Miyoji's. Ten, Ten Mi, Mi. Oh God. Mm hmm. Yeah, I nailed that one. What, what kind of, I, he's, he's wearing jeans. He's just wearing jeans. So that's not a thing. I know what a prison pocket is. <laughs> it's the anus. Or, you know, you could have double if you're a woman. Why not? Right. Probably wouldn't fit. Yeah, I don't I don't know. <laughs> but then again, Sigma not Sigma. June yeah, maybe maybe. Because Junpei in the first game did have his, you know, drawers at one point. Maybe Ten Miyoji slash Junpei just has the ability to have infinitely large pockets. Like fucking Mary Poppins pockets exist on this boy. Do you think the killer took it? I don't know. I'm gonna take a look at Clover too. Give me a minute. You're definitely not gonna find anything in her pockets. She's got anti-clothing. Fine down, knelt down next to Clover as she spoke and began to gingerly, gingerly, gingerly examine her corpse. Uh, after a moment, I saw her hand stop. Look, see your thigh? Doesn't it look like there's something written there? <laughs> That's what she used her finger for. She used the blood to write something. I'm sorry, I'll have to move your leg a little bit. <laughs> it's written in blood. It must be Ten Miyoji's. It says zero one six. Where does it say nine one zero? What does Hang that on. mean? I feel like I've seen that somewhere. Zero one six. Zero one six. I know I've seen it somewhere. <sighs> I can't remember. <laughs> Don't get my hopes anyway, up these like numbers that. have to have something to do with the killer. She must have written them after she got hit with the soparil. Oh, okay. We're not there would close. have been a few minutes before she went all the way under when she could have done something. I think she probably used those last minutes to tell the rest of us who'd killed her. <laughs> Zero one six, huh? I think that's, I, th I don't think that's a six. I think that's a backwards D and it's Dio. That's Dio. It's Dio. It's Dio backwards, it's Dio. <laughs> Cookie's on the same page as me, it's Dio. Holy diver? Oh, I don't know how to read binary. Uh, Maybe the only people who could have done it are, hey, it's Dio. <sighs> Sorry guys. Assuming it wasn't one of us, no, I No, mean. there's also Quark. I mean, I'm not saying he did it, just... Cookie did say it first, she wins. I just didn't look at chat. <laughs> Damn it, this is hopeless. I can't keep this up, I can't... I can't keep up anymore, everything here is a goddamn mystery! Sigma bro, I feel you. I feel you. What about the old woman we found who killed her? The movement of the AB rooms makes Luna seem the most suspicious, but when would she have done it? And we don't have a good explanation for why she would have wrapped the knife up in the handkerchief. And of course, Luna's dead now too, and who killed her? And who did the thing? <laughs> the footage from the security camera paired with Dio's behavior makes Clover seem like the most likely suspect, and now we'll never know for sure. <sighs> He's panicking. Alice killed was killed. Uh, Alice's killer is a complete mystery. We don't know what the hell 016 is supposed to mean. We don't have any idea where Quark's gone. 
What the hell does any of it mean? Who killed everyone? What is Zero? Zero Senior? Who's Zero Senior? What the hell does he want? Why does this game even exist? Why did they kidnap us and bring us here? Well, Raddit, where is this? When is this? <laughs> Sick was the embodiment of my entire feelings right now. Mysteries, mysteries, mysteries. I'm feeling my head's gonna explode. Please, Fi, give me anything, something. A clue, a hint, come on, you gotta have something. He's, he's reeling, he's reeling. The luminol. Huh? I think there's a very good chance someone took the spray bottle out of Ten Miyoji's pocket. Okay, but how's that important? Well, let me ask you this. Why do you think they took it? Is they could test for what blood? What do they need to do in order to do that? Uh, they need to spray the bottle wherever they want it to test. And turn off the lights. Luminol reacts with the organic compounds and glows, but the glow is really faint. So, so? You need to make it dark. You need to turn off the lights in order to make... See if anything's and glowing. that would mean... That would mean... The rec room! I don't, I don't know what we're coming to a conclusion about here. Hey, Boggs! This game should be called Infinite Escape instead of Zero Escape. Yes, 100%. Fine, I raced for the door. We weren't sure what we were going to find, but we knew where we were going. I had a feeling deep in my gut that whatever we found would be breaking, would be a breakthrough I've been looking for. Would it really? Are we gonna get a breakthrough, you guys? Or is it just more questions? Poor Sigma. He has my feels. You don't think women like to be called bitches? No, have you seen the Key and Peele sketch? They said, Nah, Boggs is at work. Boggs is working away. He's probably on his break. I hope you have a good break, babe. This is some hot door action. We are transversing. If Boggs is right behind me, I would not be streaming right now. <laughs> we would be playing Stardew. We've got a lot of work to do on our farm. Let me tell you. All right. I looked into the windows of her soul and I said, bitch. Oh my God, Nat, what the fuck? Who's killing everybody? Fuck's sake. Everything in my head ground to a halt. It's probably Quark. Quark's just going around fucking people up. Playing Stardew, is that what the kids are calling it these days? Uh-huh. Yep. Working on that farm. My brain isn't working well enough to process like anything that's happening on stream right now. Oh, Julie, it's okay. It's okay. Here's a short recap, all right? Everyone's dead. Who killed them? We don't know. There you go. It's probably Quark. Or Jora. Jora was the killer? What? You're the murderer? No, but still. <laughs> I don't have... I, I would play with you, Fat Knuckle, but there's no way in hell I'm getting an online subscription to farm online. I'm sorry. I only do local. I'm not paying another subscription to be able to play games. Who else is even alive at this point? Five Sigma Quark. That's all we got. And Quark's bracelet's already off. So I'm assuming he's also dead. Which means I don't know who the fuck's killing everybody. Oh, everything in my head ground to a halt. Even after all I'd seen, a room full of corpses had a profound effect. He's still losing it. Uh, it was such a ridiculous thought that before I could stop myself, I laughed. You know, to be fair, it could be fine. It could be fine. Hear me out. All right, hear me out. We have our radical six attack. We go lay down on the sofa to take a nice little nap. Fi allegedly was in that room going through footage the whole time. But if the world seems slow, we think we've only slept for a few minutes. 
Maybe we slept for four fucking hours. You never know. Fi manages to leave, kill a shit ton of people, right? I'm still assuming Dio probably killed Tenmyoji and Clover. But Fi comes in, kills Dio and K, which I don't know how you got through that armor. That's impressive, girl. Um, and then comes back to look like she's just going through the footage and we wake up and we think it's been a few minutes when it's really been a couple hours. There could be a naked K running around. This is totally true. There could be another Sigma. How do you recover? How did you recover from radical sex? We took a nap, apparently. That was enough to do it. No, I don't think we're fully cured. I think we'll probably go batshit uh, pretty soon. Yeah, we don't know. We don't know that K is guaranteed to be in that in that in that thing, in that suit. It could be me, maybe. It was really a blackout, not a nap at all, and I ran around killing people. Quark isn't dead. He's zero. His bracelet was never real. You think? I Quark seems sketchy as shit, man. I tell you what, there's something up with that boy. Even if his just bears in his hat. Uh, I, it was such a ridiculous thought that I that before I could stop myself, I laughed. The laugh made me think, was laughter in this situation a disfen de defense response designed to protect my brain from the constant emotional bombardment? Does it matter? Uh, they say that right before an animal dies, it feels a moment of comfort. Right before death, the brain releases a huge amount of endorphins into the bloodstream. Pain is the only uh, warning signal meant to help the body avoid death. But uh, with, when death becomes a certainty, pain no longer has any use. In fact, the loss of pain can lead to an incredibly incredible feats on the edge of death. Let's say why are we why are we having this thought right now? Why? You guys are just enjoying my quotes. When did it say MILF? I have no idea, Jorah. I don't know where this is coming from. Uh, let's say that there are two species of animals come under attack from an un overwhelming force. All of them are severely wounded and near, near death. Species A feels pain, but species B doesn't. The horrible pain felt by A prevents them from moving, but because they, they feel no pain, some of B manages to drag their wounded bodies to safety and survive. As a, revol as a result, A is eliminated and B uh, manages to survive. The process of natural selection has been repeated for thousands, no, millions of years. All creatures that walk the face of the earth are descendants from species B. I'm no exception. That's why I can look in a room full of corpses and laugh. The genes I've been given by a million years of evolution have changed my fear into ecstasy. <laughs> what is happening right now? Boo goes the bago. Why? Oh my god, now we're rioting. Alright, that's fine. You keep rioting. That's good. <laughs> Cocaine. Cocaine got in the riot. I guess this means you and I are the only Don't survivors. Don't keep saying it. Quark's still out there somewhere. If he is, he's a crazy murderer. Yeah, you're right. He is out there. Who else? Uh, who? So that would mean he killed them? I mean, you said yourself there was no way that uh, a tenth uninvited player out there was out there when Alice was killed. And we've also refuted the possibility of Zero Senior being the tenth person. There is no tenth person. Only the people, the only people alive are you, me, and Quark. You're being ridiculous. Um, I don't think I can make alert. The alerts are very like set in stone as to what you can set up. Look at their bodies. There's an ax buried in Kay's back. And the spear has been thrust all the way through Dio's stomach. Do you really think a child Quark's size could do that? Definitely. All right, then. Are you saying you killed them? Ugh. Are you insane? And just when would I have done that? I've been with you this whole time. While I took a nap. She was right. After the end of the second round of the AB game, Fi and I had been, hadn't been out of each other's sight. We'd gone through the white door, explored security, solved puzzles, all of it together. No, wait. There had been one time, one time when I wasn't watching. A few minutes in the security office when I rested on the couch. Could she have snuck out then? The rec room and the security office weren't that far away from one another. If the round trip took about a minute and she killed them in four minutes, 
and the whole thing would have only taken her five minutes. Five minutes, five minutes, Hong. Just how long had I been out? No, that wasn't really right. Right, I hadn't really been out. I just felt like everything was being fast forwarded, probably because my mental processing speed had dropped. But how long had I been like that? It might have only felt like a few seconds to me, but it could have been much longer. Did I call it or did I call it? Bye, Bago. Bye bye. Good luck at work. See you soon. If you take a five uh, minute nap in your head, it was a 30 minute nap in real life. It's true. It's true. That's even, that's like normal baseline. You add radical six on top of that, man. Woof da. Um, okay. And where had something like mental processing speed dropping come from? A radical six. <laughs> What you doing there, Fi? Checking their bodies like before. I decided to start with Dio. <laughs> Find anything? Yeah, two things, actually. Take a look at this. Oh, the bloody <laughs> knife. Wow. I am so shocked. What a stunning turn of events. I called all this. It also, I did not, I did not know that this literally has his fucking cult name on it, though. The Myrmidons. The Myrmidians? The Myr Myrmidons. The Myrmidons. I think it's the Myrmidons. Could it be the Myrmidons? Yeah. A knife? It's an engraved blade, too. Myrmidons. Is that Dunno. the name of the manufacturer? It's not a name I've ever heard of before. Look at no. the handle. The name of You've seen it before, cult. right? In Alice's fucking chest. Right. From the looks of it, I guess the blade is about 15 centimeters long. Guys, we're too good of detectives. Say it's probably about three centimeters tall and three millimeters wide. I think I've heard those like numbers before. wound cavity. 150 millimeters. Wound length, oh, 30 millimeters. That's the old lady's width. stab wound, too. <laughs> so he stabbed the old lady. He stabbed Alice. He comes back, gets his knife, and goes and stabs Tenmyoji. He's on a rampage. Be back in like 10 minutes, gotta drive home. Okay, Fat Knuckle, drive safe. Hmm, right. Well, wound cavity would be the depth of the wound, wound length, and wound width, yeah, that, in other yeah, words. Yes, the numbers describe right. the shape of the wound, and it matches the old woman, yes. Well, I was just eyeballing those measurements, so we can't be sure. Still, why does Dio I have it? have gotten it from Alice. I know that. What I mean is, why'd he take it? Uh, to stab people? Did he want to destroy the evidence? Maybe he was the that one who would killed match Alice. Up with what we saw. He killed everyone involved in 999, assuming the old lady is June. Yeah, he would have gone after, what, Tenmyoji, June, and, and uh, Kark wasn't part of it. Clover. Clover. Mm, yep, mm-hmm. No, wait. Hold on a second. I'm getting confused here. Alice would have had that knife first, right? She picked it up uh, when she found it wrapped in a handkerchief next to the AB room. Right. So he stabs the old lady, slips it down between the two crates. Alice finds it. He confronts her. He takes the knife, stabs her in the chest, has to flee the knight because someone is coming, right? Doesn't have time. I don't know how to pull the knife back out. After Clover kills Luna for thinking she killed Alice because of the position of the knife, he comes back in, takes the knife out of Alice, goes and slashes Ten Miyoji, chains up Clover to Ten Miyoji on the sink, and they die. Of course it was always Dio. Of course it was Dio. Like a flea in the night? Mm-hmm, yep. If that happened, why didn't he just take the knife then? Why leave it uh, there for us to see and then come back and get it later? I don't know. Well, we can look into that more later. First, I want you to have a look at something else. Don't what else you remember got? what I said? I found two. There was yep. the knife. What do you got? What do you got? Oh. K's key. This what do is you that, mean key. that key. That key. We found it in the Golem Bay. Uh, didn't have any idea what it was for then, though. But Alice said it might be important, so we hung on to it just in case. So Alice should have had this, right? And yeah. now Dio's got it. No. So when Dio took the knife, he also took K's key. Yeah. Wait. K's key? Oh, man. You couldn't figure it out from the shape? Mm -hmm. Naked K running around. Yeah. Get over here. Picture's worth a thousand words. Oh, my God. Let yeah, let's take, off. let's take off the helmet. Let's find out if there's a naked boy in this or not. She walked over to K's head, knelt down on one knee, and pointed to the back of it. 
You remember Open it. Th Open it. So that's it. It unlocks the suit, right? Yeah. Open it. Let's give it Open a it. shot. Open it. All right. All right. All right. Place your place your votes. I want one for there's a dead body in here. And I want a two for there's a naked dude running around on his with his two little bum tushies hanging out. So one, we're going to find the body. Two, there's no body. Fuck, of course you would choose three. <laughs> how, can, how can it be both? Oh my god, what if there's a different body stuffed in here and it's also dead? Alright, let's find out. Before I had time to prepare myself, I shoved in the key into the slot and twisted. But... <sighs> Is it stuck? It's no good. I can't get it open. <laughs> Why not? Maybe the suit is powered, and it needs to be on in order to open. Every time I think, oh yeah, we'll have a, we'll get a, we'll get the answer something. We're gonna look, we're gonna look straight at my face, and it's gonna be Sigma. Nope, never mind. Just kidding. <laughs> but with this axe in here. <laughs> You're saying, uh, it shorted the suit out or something? I think something? so. At any rate, the key fits perfectly. I don't have any doubt it's for removing Kay's suit. <laughs> Do you think Dio knew that when mm, he took it? I wonder. He took it for funsies? No, Julie, 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 Julie. It's literally us. It's literally someone that looks like Sigma. That's all we know. We saw his face once. It's us. I'm guessing it's a robot, like the Cockney robot, right? With a Sigma meat suit stuffed into a suit of armor. That's my running theory still. Guess we'll never know what his face yeah. really looks like. No way we can get that mask off with our bare hands. I will go find a fucking robot. Well, I still haven't checked him over. Let's have a look. Maybe we'll find something that'll tell us who he is. It was us, but now it's Nick, I see. She was only searching for a few seconds before she pulled something out of Kay's Look. robes. What is it? A spray bottle with luminol in it. Oh, well, there's that. It's the one Tenmyoji yeah. had. How could you be certain? How could you be sure? They're literally in a room with a freezer full of them. I guess maybe it's a fridge. Um, then does that mean Kay was the one who handcuffed we them to the yet. sink? Kay might have taken the spray from Tenmyoji after he died. This guy's the worst detective I've ever seen in my life. Possible he made it through the white doors before we did. Went to the infirmary and got this. Or you could have gotten it from the cooler anyway, literally behind you. There's something I want to see. Turn off the lights. Okay. Gonna check for a yeah. luminol reaction? If Kay used the spray before he died. We might still be able to see it. There's blood everywhere in That's here. That's okay. Though. If he didn't spray it, there won't be a reaction from any of it. Come on. All right, do it. Blood everywhere. Semen up the wall? It's gonna be. It's gonna Thanks. be question hour. Other dead bodies are gone. That's fine. <laughs> hmm, just as I thought. Look, Dio's left wrist. The underside of the bracelet's glowing. Exactly. Because why? there are traces of blood on it. It makes blood glow in the dark, basically. We've Who's seen blood? five people with serious bleeding. The old woman, Alice, Ten Miyoji, and these two here. I'm disinclined to think this is Dio or Kay's blood, though. See? If you look, it's been wiped off. Except for the luminol, the bracelet... Why would someone wipe Oops. blood off a bracelet after being hit with an axe or stabbed with a spear and then spray it with luminol? It was the old lady's bracelet. It doesn't make sense. That leaves the old woman, Alice, and Tenyoji. Right. Because it's fucking messy. You want to clean this shit up. Exactly. Do you remember what Tenryoji said to us in this room? Can I see the other side of your bracelets? Please, just do it. Do you think Tenryoji had figured out that one of the bracelets would have blood on that it? That would have meant he was looking for either Alice's blood or the old woman's. Mm -hmm. I wonder which, which it was. No idea. But no, whatever the case, lady. Tenryoji seemed to think that whoever had this bracelet was Ciro Sr. Just relax, okay? That's all I needed to know. Neither one of you is Ciro Sr. Are you saying that because there wasn't any reaction from the luminol? Naked K killed Dick Butt because he somehow found out that Dick Butt killed the old lady. Why would Naked K care about the old lady? Ten Miyoji cared about the old lady. 
Oh, no, that's right. No, Kay did care because that was the old woman that was taking care of him. It was like a mother to him or whatever. So Kay 100% probably stabbed Dio. But then why the fuck? But his suit's dead. He's dead. Yeah. I don't know. I guess he could be running around naked. Are you saying that Dio is senior? I don't know. Zero, zero, pff, we gotta stop. This is bad. Zero senior. The only thing I can yeah, say yeah. for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Kay's mom. I figured it out. that there's a possibility that I Dio killed that the other six victims. <laughs> the other six. She's the one who killed Dio. after he was attacked, he used the last of his strength. Oh, I see. Okay. Another descendant of species B. Huh? Give me naked K, please no. All of this would be over. All right. I think naked K is the old lady who faked her death so she could infect Quark and murder everyone and, have, and then axe herself in the back with her head in the what? armor. Jesus, that would be so elaborate. If Zero Senior was Dio, then all of this would this be over. This awful game would be over. That's true. But it's not. An M40? What is happening? Quark. That's impossible! Fucking Quark! Whatever. We need to get back to the Floor A warehouse. Hurry! Fucking Quark? Are you shitting me? He's actually the mastermind. Him and his fucking root beer. He's actually the mastermind this entire time. This four-year-old boy. He's not four. How old is he? Like 10? 11? I think they've said it before. I just can't remember. Can you imagine bears in his hat though? The bears! He's definitely guilty of having bear hat. Oh, fuck. I love that you guys have to put fuck in chat literally just to bring up my fuck. Fuck you, dick child. Open it up. Open it up, rooms. He's gonna already be in the pod and we won't know who it is. And we're like, whoa, who's voting? He already has nine. And he doesn't even have his bracelet. Damn it, there's no one here. Did they run Why off? they run away? Hell if I know. They're in their pod. How the hell did Quark open an AB gate anyway? Without the star key, uh, he shouldn't have been able to he get it open. He must have taken open. one from Dio or K before we got to the rec room. Mm -hmm. We know they went through a white door, remember? We saw the footage in the security office. That means they had a star key just like we did. But you didn't find one when you searched them? Right. Maybe Quark's the suspect after all, then. We shouldn't write him off just because he's a kid. Maybe he knows how to use a lance or, or an axe. That's impossible. I was the... And, and ants. Being an idiot, it's much more likely he found the key card after they died. Oh. Mm. All right, Any let's go find him. Where to look? Right, we have to go fucking looking for this kid again. Just stay here and goddamn vote. How on earth would I know where mm. he might be? Well, there's one place I'd like to check out. Come on. You know something I don't. I can't keep up with any of this crap. Nobody else can either. It's fine. Right. Aren't you curious? Of course. Besides, Quark might yeah. be there. Let's move. Oh, that was an that was actually a hot door action. It was nice and white. Super hot. Director's office. Probably belongs to the director. Director's office. I hope it has one of those chairs. Cheers. You know, the folding ones that says director on the back. I've always wanted to sit in one and say stuff like action, cut. Or double decaf chai soy latte now. And that's what you think we'll find in there? Yup. Yeah. Are you well, excited? Well, there could be anything in there. So, no. Not really. So, what if Zero Senior was in there waiting for us? That would make us? things easy. We'd settle things right now and then get the hell out. What if Zero Senior is older Quark? We saw Zero Senior and it was like this old dude in this strange jacket that wasn't any of us. So what if it's Quark from the future? Mm. Okay, I'm gonna open it. You don't need to keep asking me if... Just fucking open the door. Sigma is an adorable idiot. 100%. Or some guy Quark paid to do it. Mm. Mm-hmm. I can see that too. 
I've got it. He's stuck in the safe. We did this room. We did this room last time. With the business cards. There's no one here. My computer's been turned yeah. on. Yeah. Maybe Dio and Kay did that. What the hell a is this? Lion. A sun. A couple of input fields for user ID and we'll password. We can't use it unless we know what those are. Why don't you put something in? Sure. I'll give it a shot. Yeah, just as I thought. <laughs> just type random letters? What is that? If the old lady is in fact Connie, then good odds that she'd pull the same game as she did before. You think so? I feel like she'd just be too tired and old for that shit. Might as well forget about this thing for now. <laughs> Lion and boar. Mm -hmm. We can't get anywhere without a password. Let's see if we can find any other clues. This is the director's office after all. If we turn the place upside down, we're bound to find something. Oh my god, we're still on the Shall same we? fucking node. We'll be here for the rest of our lives. We five headed towards the bookshelf, leaving me alone at the desk. I felt compelled to stay and found myself staring at the screen. A lion biting the sun, a lion biting the sun, a lion biting the sun. Not only a lion, but it's a two headed lion. Remember death, if the ninth lion ate the sun. Could this be the ninth lion? Then maybe. We have seen a lot of fucking lions. Remember death. We're remembering all the people who have died. If they aren't actually that much older, they're only how much older Clover is too. And then something happened to them to make them look super old. That just hurt my fucking head, but I think I know what you mean. <laughs> Wait, these are deaths that didn't even happen in this timeline now. We're talking about all kinds of deaths. Okay. Alright, we're having a brain blast. We're getting past the story check. We're doing it. We're doing it. What's that password? Did we do it? Fuck me? I mean, I wrote some stuff down, but it was like bomb related. Um, uh, L, oh, I can't just type, fuck me. L, X, A, Q, N, S, G, that's another Q. I don't, I, fuck, I have literally no idea. That's my guess. Let's just cheat, though, because holy shit. Um... Oh wait, maybe, maybe it's in the archive. Maybe we should search for it in here. Oh. No. Oh. No. Oh. Oopsie. Oh. All right, let's just like. Man, we've been through a lot of shit. Look at how much shit we've been through. Oh yeah, what was that one about? Another day. Hmm. These are all just like these, right? Grandpa videos? Uh, you know what? I don't want to know. I don't want to know. Uh, 
Um. We must know. We must know. The Batman symbol. Uh huh. Yep. That's how you get it. The root beer float. Oh no, that's the cold sleep. Oh. SOS. Law of Robotics. The gentle points! It's in here. It's in here. It's those gentle points. Okay, whatever. It's <laughs> not what I want right now. Let me just picture. Oh, fuck. Help. Oh, God. Um. Let's click on the section that says major spoiler FAQ. <laughs> Just kidding. Um, what does this mean? Nope, I don't want to know anything about that. What room are we in? We're in the director's office, right? Okay, hold on. Hmm. Hmm. We started out, okay, we went, mm. Oh my God, I don't even know. Oh, oh boy. Yes, Paladin, yes. I have no idea, Cookie. Uh, not much longer if I can't fucking find... So, the, yes, the pa this is the password from K right here. I did write that down. That's right there. I don't know what the ID could be, though. So, I'm just trying to find something to confirm what I would like to know. Um... Let's just Google it straight out and say, fuck you, wiki. Um, blah, blah, blah. I don't think we're supposed to know. I don't think we're supposed to know. Oh, it's just gonna keep looping? It was no good, I didn't know anything. Yeah, I don't think we're supposed to know. Uh, I couldn't shake the feeling that I'd seen the ID password somewhere before. Uh, yeah, mm -mm. I'm pretty sure the password is what Kay gave us, but let me look at the flow chart. Let me see where that put us. It might be a locked story check. Oh no, it's just like a, you need to fucking figure it out check. Interesting. I don't think we're supposed to know. Mm -mm. No. Figure it out later. Oh god, I just fucked up. Guess we get to watch the beginning again.
I think we need, it sounds like we need Quark's route is what it's sounding like. <laughs> good night, Cookie. Have a good night. Thank you for being here. Um, okay, next time let's just do like a, let's, uh, let's come over here and betray over here. And that might get us somewhere. I don't even know. I have no idea what this route is. Betray. I don't know what's happening. <laughs> We're betraying. <clears throat> oh my god. So not only does this game have story locks, it also apparently has password locks. Great. Um, okay, we're gonna stop here because I'm tired. I don't, my brain can't even. I don't know what's happening. We're stuck. I mean, we're not stuck. We have so much more to do, but um, next time, which is Thursday, Friday. Hold on. When the fuck did I say I was streaming? I am so out of it. <laughs> Friday. Next stream is Friday. All right, we got that down. Next stream is Friday. We will probably bust this out. This may or may not expand. Who knows? Um, if we get through this and it's just a dead end, we'll hop over here and start to do some of that because that sounds great. Look at how much we've already done. We've done a ton. We've gotten four people's actual endings. We're missing Alice, Quark, Phi, myself, uh, Luna. Okay, we're missing more than we've gotten. We're almost halfway there. <laughs> Hopefully this doesn't expand anymore. All right, we will stop there. Um, I'm just gonna go ahead and say goodnight instead of doing a raid, um, but I'll throw some up, someone up to host so that if you guys are sticking around, you can still have some entertainment. Um, let's do our quick thank yous before we go. Maybe, come on, you can do it. I believe in you, Streamlabs. I probably shouldn't after yesterday, but I believe in you. Uh, so, Spellcaster, thank you for the host. And Furu, Furu Suzu, thank you for the follow at the end of last night's stream. Thank you so much for the support. Uh, thank you guys so much for being here and hanging out with me, even though I'm super pooped and nothing makes sense and it was a disaster as usual. Dumpster fire for the win, am I right? Um, I will see you all on Friday for more VLR and potentially some more answers. I think we just got more questions this time again. <sighs> Maybe one day we'll get answers. Maybe it'll all be worth it. Who knows? <laughs> I hope you guys have a wonderful night. Thank you so much for being here. Uh, sleep well and I will see you all Friday. Bye-bye.